Make a city that only has one road. How would that work? So, th this makes it really weird for space because I've, I, I don't have to worry about, like... Well, okay, no, I still have to worry about it slightly. It's kind of like Snake now. Because I can't retread any land, so I have to make sure I'm making the most of the land I've got. The only bit of, like, connection road is just gonna be that there. That's so they have a way out. So there's no way I can really plan stuff, like, down, like, literally down the road. I have to just build stuff on as we get it. So, like, right now that they they want indus- uh, they, they want commercial. So the next bit is going to be commercial. Now, presumably this eliminates all sources of traffic because everyone's just going in a straight line. There's no turning points. There shouldn't be any reason for people to stop other than just pull in when they get to their house. Country road, not roads. <laughs> Those guys would complain about no water. Ah, uh, why'd you build your homes out here? I, I zoned it, don't answer that. So now I'm gonna take out a second loan. And with part of that second loan, I'm gonna pay back the first loan. Okay, now we can keep this part of the road safe with the police, or this part of the road safe. So far, it's working really well. Like, I, I don't even see any issues with this right now. Maybe this is the way you're supposed to play the game. Italics, thanks for the two months. Paying back loans with loans, sign me up for the inevitable pyramid scheme. I, I thought there would be much more traffic, but if someone's pulling in, you just go in one of the other two lanes. It, it, it works like an actual motorway. If you're turning in to your house, go on the right lane. Otherwise, go on the other two and you just keep going. And you have just clear road ahead of you. Oh my god, we should just be building houses on the motorway. I'm a genius. I've, I've solved all traffic problems. This is possibly the stupidest city we've done yet, and this may actually be the most successful by far. Oh yeah, and oh wait, 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 sorry. I forgot a very important thing. We have to name the road. You know, there's only one name we can give it. Meteorologists are whoa, issuing whoa. a thunderstorm warning for the coming days. This one wasn't me. Natural disasters are still illegal, so... It struck the police station, are you kidding me? God broke the law, RT, you can't let this slide. <laughs> hey, where do you live? Oh, I live on 491. On the street, dude, there's only one road. Uh, which number is your house? Uh, it's like, uh, 2,728. I'm on the left. Okay, I'll see you in four to five hours. I just being at the end of the road and you want to leave. You'd have to, like, stop in a hotel along the road. Just to even get out. This is probably the most efficient city, like, we've ever designed. And it's just because there's no turning points. Like, people just go to where they want. It's just a one-stop, like, highway. If it ever gets backed up, like, we're so dead. What's going on with the freaking water? Oh god, whoa, 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 it's flooding. Okay, this is gonna be a problem. Okay, we need a barrier. We gotta get a bus line going, by the way, because, like, the bus line is literally gonna be the easiest thing imaginable to organize. No, so it, it, it actually doesn't have anywhere to turn. I can't, I can't finish the line. Okay, we're just gonna build a monorail system instead. Why isn't there six-lane monorail? Okay, we don't need public transport. You, if you don't have a car, you're fecked. The end of the street is called Harvey Street. What? The road was so long, it gave it a new name. There's, there's so many buses. Jesus Christ. There, there's no bus line. They're all waiting. <laughs> Guys, you gotta get on the other side of the road. They have no passengers. I don't, I don't, I don't think they can ferry anyone. Is there anyone riding all these buses? Well, we have a phantom bus line. Um, that's fine. All right, it's time to take a br brave new step. So for the next bit of road, we're gonna buy this tile and we're gonna go all the way. Summon an asteroid? No, natural disasters are banned. Say no to meteors. What is wrong with the water too? Like, why is it constantly doing this? It's really trying to flood against us. Like, I'm glad we built the wall so we're safe. Here we go, lads, and I, no, we're going all in. Look at this. It's beautiful. These guys are just making the track just to turn around. They just want to get to the other side of the road. Like, like... This guy has like weeks ahead of him just to pick up the bins on the other side. We must spam chat to remove pylons? Which pylons? Oh, these ones? Good luck with that movement there, guys. Let me know how it goes. RT, did you take a loan or is your city tr uh, just driving? It's, it's it's just doing really well. I'm gonna pay back my other loan. I'm just, uh, like, I'm just so good at city design. Hang on, my income's tanking. 
I yeah, they all ran out of workers. That's fine. I didn't want these ones anyway. That's probably incredibly dangerous considering how much the water surge in here. Um, but we're not the ones working in the plant, so it's okay. This is the pro. Oh my god! No wonder they're complaining about there being no water. The water freaking disappears every now and then. Hydro power plant reach a population of eleven thousand. That's the next goal. We're gonna dam the river. Oh, just don't turn on the kettle for a while. Oh, just look at this. It's it's just beautiful to watch this. They just keep building up along the road as it keeps going. You have to go all the way around, turn, drive back this way, go out of the city, and then like turn on the intersection somehow. Just to make that trip. Now you, you, you could just walk too. Why are they all waiting for the bus? There's, we don't have buses, they're just bus stops. What are they waiting for? There's another dog, he's also waiting for the bus. For this guy to drive home and park his car, he's gotta go all the way around. He has to go to the very end of the road every time. That 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 guy's up for the challenge though, apparently. He just built a house there. There we go. The next part of the road. Now they have to go even further if they want to turn around. That one's Harvey Street again. Oh my god. Every time. Oh, I probably shouldn't put the dump right next to the hospital, but it fits so well. You look at the same road from the corner at the very end of the road, see a cool restaurant, and decide, hey, I want to eat there. You call and place reservations for two weeks ahead, and immediately get in the car to head over there. Two weeks later, you finally get there. You then place reservations for a restaurant next to your house. For two weeks later, you get home in time to change, and get to the restaurant. The cycle repeats. It's like the most efficient city we've designed yet, but probably like the most like evil of the lot. Because just the um, like commute time to get anywhere is like absurd. RT made me drive the road. <laughs> this is what Cormac McCarthy based his novel on. Like this is the dystopian world he described in The Road. He didn't mean the apocalypse or anything. He just meant like it's a hell of a fucking commute. Meteorologists have issued a severe tornado warning. For tornado warning. 74k. Oh my god. Okay, well, look, get to the bottom of the road quick. There's a shelter, it can house everyone along the road. You just have to make the run. Oh no, it's gonna break the road. Oh my god, the freaking car is in stand of chance. Those guys are dead. No, it's following the road! Oh, you can't even make this up. Okay, we, 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 oh my god, no, we're losing, oh my god, our money. No. The tornado has actually put plumbing us into financial ruin. I can't repair the road, I have no money. Bankruptcy. Yeah, okay, take that, pause it. I gotta be real quick here with upgrading the roads. That's the fatal flaw in our city then. If a single disaster hits, like, that's it. If that, if anything happens to that road, like, we're, we're so screwed. Because it just cuts the city in half. Citizen happiness, they're all ecstatic, apart from these losers. Don't care about them. And, like, only half the road is, like, horribly polluted. Yeah, there's a school. Ah, oh, and you lit yourselves on fire. Guys, there's only so much I can do. Or to you, Team Smith or Team Harvey. Uh, the Team Harvey isn't a thing, okay? You can't just force this. It's Team Smith. Obviously. Small city. Well, priorities first. We're building the dam. There we go. So I this promise I'm making a new road. No, this this one's not connected though. This, this isn't a real road. This is just the dam. It it's swamped. What was the point of this? It was too low. Well, how do I make it higher? There we go. The new dam. Oh, it ain't getting past that one. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no! Whoa 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 whoa. Oh no. I didn't want this to happen today. Almost heaven. West Virginia. God damn it. Even when I try, I can't get it right. Oh wait, we just saved it. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on.
Well, that moment was just completely ruined. You can't just do that. So, we learned a valuable lesson today. Fuck dams. I was looking for, like, the shitty recorder version. What? What? I didn't even do that. No, we're going back in the timeline. Do I don't have to keep this, like, broken freaking dam. Or the entire city will flood. It's in your DNA, man. <laughs> Let's see if I can delete the dam. What? How does that make any sense? Okay, flood wall is protecting us. Flood wall is protecting us. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. The game wants it. Like, we are fighting against, like, reality itself right now. I'm trying to keep this city alive. In an interesting twist. Probably putting the pylons here and electrocuting everyone isn't helping my case. Okay, maybe this will pass and not cause too much damage. We're okay. We're in the clear. No country roads today. Just this one time, everybody lives. Uh, apart from that one guy whose house is currently on fire. Uh, he lived too. Christmas miracle.